What's some guys? There you go, dude. Today got the Texas shirt on, specifically Mr. Watt, Mr. 99, Big 99. Just because this this video ain't gonna be about that game. They're a heartbreaking loss. We fought real hard, real hard. Defense just wasn't able to get stops. Heartbreaking loss once again. But like I said, we're not here to talk about that game. We're here to talk about what Mr. Watt said. And first and foremost, I want to apologize to Mr. Watt. JJ, I'm sorry. I questioned his loyalty. I questioned his fire, his passion. I questioned if he really even wanted to be in Houston anymore. I don't know if I ever said publicly on the channel, but I know I have privately been like, I don't know if JJ gonna stay here. I don't know if JJ gonna stay here. I don't know what JJ gonna do. And yesterday's interview, first and foremost, if you haven't seen it, go watch it. Link is gonna be in the description. But after that interview, that pass and that fire that spewed from him after that post interview, I was like, okay, JJ. Okay, JJ, let him know. Let them know. What that tells me, if there's a whole bunch of people in that organization, on that team, who playing around, who don't care about when, who ain't putting the work, who ain't doing anything to contribute to this team. And JJ's letting them know, basically, get it together or you're not going to be here next season. Because JJ holds that kind of way. JJ is probably the main person who went O'Brien gone. And guess what? O'Brien's gone. So... For JJ to come out and say something like this, first of all, it shows his love and appreciation for the city of Houston, for the fans. People like me who make YouTube videos about the Houston Texans, even though we suck, and people who are still going to games in the middle of a pandemic when we suck, and just just people who are still riding for our team, people who will ride for this team regardless of anything. JJ Y said, you know what, I know y'all are out there, I know y'all are hurting, and we have to be better. We have to be better. But yeah, man, he was spitting facts because it's like, they're, they're really getting paid handsomely, millions of dollars, you know what I'm saying? They're well off to play a sport. You know what I'm saying? So, at least you could do is to be engaged, give it your all. You know what I'm saying? Have a little ugh about it, you know what I'm saying? Hit the gym, run a couple laps, work on your craft, something. You know what I'm saying, man? Because of all the jobs in the world, it's not the worst. It's definitely not the worst. And it trends towards one of the best and fun and probably more rewarding jobs in this world. You know what I'm saying? When you think about people who get paid nothing to like make shoes or something you know what i'm saying i that was a terrible example but you you get the gist you get the gist because there's a whole bunch of people out here who doing stuff that they hate doing stuff they dislike and not getting paid a lot of money for it and then you have these professional athletes getting paid millions of dollars to do something they love to play a sport they love you know what i'm saying so the least you can do is work hard the least you can do is be considerate of the fans and people who pay their money, who give their attention, who give their time, who give their lives, who spend hours and hours talking about your team or investing in your team or something. And so some support, man. I mean, you, you can't win them all, right? But you can at least try. And I think JJ's biggest thing is there's people in that organization, there's people on that roster who aren't trying. They're just not. They're just flat out not trying. And so, honestly, I feel like those people aren't going to be here. I feel like after the season's over, there's going to be a whole bunch of cuts. There's going to be a whole new regime, and we're going to have to turn it around and get it back rolling. But yesterday, Speeds let me know, J.J. going to stay around. J.J. loves Houston. Houston loves J.J. We're trying to win for J.J. J.J.'s trying to win for us. J.J. still got that fire. He still got that passion. I'm positive. Next year, completely different. He going to be motivated. The song going to be motivated. Let Will Fuller come back. Will Fuller got some improved. You know what I'm saying? I just... Man, man, oh man, oh man. But that's all I got for y'all. Um, season's over next week, you know what I'm saying? So, be a recap video next week. But hey man, jump down in the comments, let me know what you think about JJ's speech, what you what you feeling about, what you, what you think you think you gonna stay, you think you gonna go. Let me know what you think in the comments. But hey man, say man, hope you enjoyed this video, that like this video, share this video, I already told you comment, but hey, comment on this video. Y'all stay icy, God love all else, dexterity and